Ring in the new year with amazing savings from Appalachian Wireless. Get the Galaxy S7 for just $49.99 when you sign or renew a two-year service agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. When heavy rain falls in Pike County, residents who live along Elkhorn Creek expect the water to rise. But the nearly two inches of rain that fell Sunday night and Monday was just too much for this bridge to handle. And it's the only bridge connecting six families to the main road. And although they have had worries about this bridge before, Monday morning residents knew this time was different. The garbage that was backing up against the bridge was creating a damming effect. And we noticed that it was causing the water to start churning and being forced up underneath our bank again. The Cantrells and their neighbors began calling the Pike County Road Department, asking for help. Get an excavator, have, a, have them reach out with that arm and clean that garbage out from behind that bridge. Let it go on through before we no longer have a bridge. When I got here, the bridge was, all but gone. I was afraid to put a piece of equipment on it, endangering somebody's life, and didn't feel it would be worth it. The swift water continued its assault until the bridge collapsed around 3 p.m., essentially trapping the residents. And going into Monday night, they could only hope that no emergency situations developed overnight. It was probably more scary for uh, for some of our neighbors more so than us because we have one neighbor who's a little older, and uh, she was worried. Early this morning, Pike County officials met with a neighbor and have worked out a temporary solution. Uh, our neighbor has gave us permission to go across his property to their bridge and out. Should have it within the next few hours, a decent road for them to travel. As we have seen so many times, many solutions to problems in eastern Kentucky are found when neighbors roll up their sleeves to help each other. And that's exactly what has happened here. Reporting in Pike County for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.